Okay, today we're going to go through a demo for a prescription import into a GS3. Uh, the first thing we want to do is uh, put in the thumb drive here on the side slot, um, put it in, and wait for it to come up for prescription. Um, and then you'll get to this screen, and you want to hit Import Global Prescriptions and Shapefile Data. So you want to hit that number. Um, and then, uh, more than likely, if you don't have any uh, prescriptions from last year, you want to click Import RX, and then it will import that data. And I might remind you, um, these files are in an RX folder on the thumb drive, so the monitor can um, see that when it's looking for it. And then, like I said there, it's going through uh, the transfer, and the transfer is complete. So we hit um, accept, and we'll accept through that. Um, go ahead and accept that, and then we're going to hit the screen down here, which gets you to your main screen. Uh, and one, one thing we want to do before we start, we want to change uh, the rate six to um, a prescription or an RX uh, button for our, for our planter. So we want to go to the planter setting here, and we want to go to, uh, this will be un under the H tab, which I happen to be already on, and then we want to go to show rates for corn. And then this one here is set up, it only has one target population of 30,000, so we want to go in here to change rates, and we want to um, actually turn off rate 1, and if you have any other rates, rate two, rate three, you want them to all be off when when you're planting your prescription. So we turn rate one off, and then we want to go to rate six, and we want to turn on rate six, and then that target is going to be called RX. So that's that's the one we want on, and then we're going to hit the uh, arrow here. Uh, for our next screen, and we want to arrow through that again, so then all of our uh, rates are are set for the prescription. On the next step here, we want to go um, and go into our field and bring in the actual prescription. Uh, we go into the green star, the D button here, um, and then we want to go uh, actually, we have to remove the thumb drive before we can go to the Green Star screen. Uh, your prescriptions will be saved in this monitor, so you don't have to keep your thumb drive in. Um, and you can see I've got test for the client, test for farm, and test for field. You guys will put your own uh, farm and field names in there. Uh, and then one thing we want to do is... Uh, okay. We want to go to the documentation tab, um, which is I, and this is where we're actually going to bring in the prescription. Uh, RX down here in the bottom right hand corner, we want to hit that, and then we want to go and find our prescription. So I'm, I'm going to go to shape file, and you can see we, we've got some different options here. I'm going to select this top one. Uh, Actually, I'm going to select Buchanan. And then we want to go seeds by seed count. And then we want to make sure down here at the bottom to put in out of field rate and loss of GPS rate. Uh, you guys can select those in your uh, when you're putting this together, what, what your comfortable seeding rate is. So those are already in, so we want to hit accept. Uh, it's going to convert the shape file right now, and you can see we brought up the shape file, and we've got a range here of 33 to 39,000, um, and then you can also click on this map to see it, and then we're going to hit accept. Now this is what um, the next screen comes to where we can put in the multiplier, which um, let's say I've got 0636 Pioneer in my planter. Um, I want to do a prescription multiplier for 1.0 or 107%. So that's going to plant 7% over our prescription. Um, and this is just an example. 
and I'm going to hit accept. And then that's saying that you're, we're going to plan 107% of our prescription right here. So if we're okay with that, then we're going to hit accept. And then this is going to say prescription multiplier not 100%, but we're okay with that. So now um, our, our prescription is in the monitor. And the next thing we want to do is add a variety. And like I said, we're going to use... Um, is an example 0636 so we've got that on there and then you can pick your different colors and we just want to hit accept so now your planter is ready to plant 0636 with that prescription at 107 percent